is New York City, where a hundred Spider-Men from different dimensions will be trapped in trying to maintain peace. Within the city, there's the likes of Dr. Octopus, Kingpin, and even an experiment running loose across the city. Players are also set to hardcore mode, so they only have one life. For every subscriber we get on this video, I will be placing one TNT on my friend's hardcore world. So don't miss your chance, because we're almost at 300k. This is the 100 player Spider-Verse simulation. Our story begins with one average Joe of a kid. Well, he's a bit weird sometimes, but it's my friend Oweka. He's going to be the Miles Morales of this story, and we're going to be calling him the hero. For some reason, he loves breaking into people's houses like the common trespasser he is, and ends up meeting some very strange looking spiders. I think you guys know where this is headed. Bro, bro! What the heck? He escapes the spiders, but realizes that he doesn't feel too good, but continues to make his way home. His senses end up being heightened, Subscribe. and he starts hearing things that he normally wouldn't be able to hear at all. The voice says, he wakes up at a rooftop, surrounded by Spider-Man from different dimensions. Oh, oh what is... What is this called, dude? Man, back up! Back up! All of you! Back up! Give me my space! Stop looking at me! All saying that they came here because of one big threat. King Pin. So they made an alliance to save the city from the immediate danger. And this is when Oweka realized that he too is a Spider-Man now because of the spider bite that he dealt. Our hero puts on his suit for the very first time ready to begin and pursue on his enemy. Or should I say all 100 Spider-Man's enemies? Oweka was a bit overwhelmed by this fiasco though, so instead of staying with them at all times, he'd flee the scene and call them when they are needed. His spider senses sent him to a very strange looking building. He ended up exploring it in search for what was wrong and why he was sent there in the first place. After realizing that the location was filled with bandits, thugs, and even supplies, he called in the spider team. That's also what I'll be calling the 100 spider man at his disposal. The other 100 Spider-Men also got the same spidey sense of there being danger. Suddenly, a group of thugs and bandits appear out of nowhere, like they came out of where, and began attacking the innocent citizens. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, they're getting, they're getting rocked. <laughs> they're actually beating up the thugs with their hands, bro. And amongst those citizens was another spider person, which looked very similar to the Spider-Man in this universe. They saved them. Look at like a little bro happy and stuff look at him look at you without hesitation the spider-man jump into action the issue with a lot of the spider-man is their suits were gone stolen from them underneath their feet by the green goblin if they wanted their suits back they'd have to face the green goblin head on and take what's rightfully theirs most of the spider-man had to rely on hand-to-hand -hand combat and luckily for them they weren't too bad at that stuff either the thugs and bandits were no match for the hundred spider-man or so they thought with them being able to predict enemy movements it did make it a bunch easier for them to dodge attacks and strike back against the thugs for once it's the spider-man that outnumbered the bad guys like that never happens but some of the spider-man did end up fighting and dying within this fight no suit means they're more likely to take heavy amounts of damage so you guys want a weapon you guys want a weapon to use yeah no no yeah okay <laughs> they ended up picking up weapons to fight against the thugs after a bit the thugs were getting annihilated like the honey bun i ate last night another thing they used was explosives to deal a bit of damage to more of the civilians i meant the bad guys not 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 the civilians oh 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 peter already peter oh Jeez, dude. Jeez. Oh, careful, Clancer. Be careful. Oh, jeez. He's getting ganged up on. Oh, my God. Someone just blew them up entirely. A bit weird of a method, though. I don't know how safe it is for, you know, superheroes to use explosives. But you know what? We'll let it slide for now. You know, they're not even at their home dimension. After rescuing the OG Spider-Man, he points them at a tall building. And the Spider-Man decide to investigate it. What are you guys up to? Are you burning trees down? What the heck? And their first task was to kill the thug leader. If you guys can kill these two, you guys all get suits. With, um... The spider web swinging stuff too. Yeah. Good luck. All right. There he is. There's the thug leader. Oh. Oh. Oh, they got him. They got him. They uncover that the green goblin was behind the gathering of thugs in pursuit of killing any Spider-Man that gets in his way. So then a fight breaks loose. 100 Spider-Men versus the green goblin. It was a huge back and forth fight between these two, with the green goblin poisoning the Spider-Man any chance that he got. The fight even goes to leading them outside of the building. But with enough back and forth between these Spider-Men and the green goblin,
Goblin, some did end up dying for the sake of figuring out how the Green Goblin even ties in with Kingpin in the first place. After seeing the danger pop up, Iron Man decides to help him out with this fight, but Iron Man was never a person that was supposed to be in this universe at all. Guess he came through the rift as well. The Green Goblin has a lot of spider blood on his hands, but after a while he was pinned and killed off. Not captured, but killed, like proper dead. I don't know if the Spider-Men we have here are really on the good side. Not before long, another thing happened. Some decided to commit arson on the buildings and the homes to damage the Green Goblin. What are you guys thinking? You're supposed to be the city saviors. It's heroes, not the citywide arsonists. Some of the Spider-Men were trying to put out the flames with their webs, but I think it made the fire spread a little bit more than they probably intended to. They're not the smartest bunch, but you know what? They're the city's last hope, I, I think. Oh God, it's happened. It's happened. The spider manification of the world has happened. Oh geez. Oh, oh God. Oh. <laughs> Ohio Feet Tickler? What kind of name is that? Oh my gosh. The amount of webs is everywhere. I survived a burning building. They're burning down everything. Oh, is that a Spider-Man playing basketball? What are you playing? Playing basketball and stuff. Yeah, now you're trapped. Now you're buried. Yeah, these are not the best superheroes at all. Oh, there's a lot of mobs in here. Oof. Ooh, they're using their abilities and stuff. Okay. Why are the houses burning down? I don't know, buddy. I, I, I can't tell you. What are you doing? <laughs> Dude, what? Afterwards, our hero went searching for the organization that was helping out the Green Goblin. Cause surely they're not the only people that were out and about doing crime. We on the hunt for some bad guys. He ended up at some weird storage unit holding energy cells, which could cause either another rift to open up or even worse. And he decided to get the place to blow up and webbed up some of the bandits. Afterwards, he swung around the city a bit more while the other Spider-Men explored the city bound a bit. They were kind of just waddling around, but it was very chaotic and very laggy. He ends up swinging on top of a huge building and tries to get my attention to strike a deal with me. Adrian. Yeah, what's up? Okay, look, 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 look. Can we make a deal? Mmm, it depends on what the deal is. You know that. Okay, okay, okay. I know I'm gonna sound crazy here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Again, I think I'm the only good Spider-Man around town. Bro, there's a hundred Spider-Men, and you're saying you're the only nah, good one? No. Nah. Nah. <laughs> what? Look, 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 look. I say I'm okay. the only good one because they be killing Matt. Like, okay, okay. Have you looked at any of the buildings? Bro, that's the Spider-Man yeah, doing that, bro. The, 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 the ones that are, like, burning, struggling to stay afloat. Yes. Uh, dude, I genuinely believe I'm the only one trying to actually help people here. Okay. But where's the where's so, the deal in that? So, for like the city's sake and whatnot, uh, after after Kingpin, the final boss, if I can kill him mm -hmm. instead of I'm the one who kills him, I finish him off. You have to kill every single one of them, all the other guys. All, all 99. Guys. Yes, bro, and leave me to protect the city. Leave me to be the last Spider-Man. Not gonna lie, Oak, you're sounding a little a little power hungry there. I'm not. I'm. Not. Okay, 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 okay. I mean, you know, you do have a history of being a little, little chaotic, but you know I what? Know, bro. I see your point. You know, they, they are causing a, a whole lot of harm, and I don't know if it's doing anyone any good, but... Look, it's like, it's like if you, if you, like, say, okay, this is gonna sound crazy, but say if I were to, it's like me giving a baby, uh, uh, uh like a, a, a lollipop, and then, like, literally throwing it into, into the ground, into concrete. It's like, so what if you save people, you burn them the next second, you know what I mean? What? You didn't, you didn't really hear me out, you know okay. <laughs> you know, you know what? Deal, deal. If you beat Kingpin, you know, he's kind of like one of the worst villains in this dimension of yours, then I will kill off all the rest, and you could be the only person in this universe to do whatever you please. Thank you, Adrians. He wants wanted to eliminate the other Spider-Man. Seems like he started realizing the people we brought over here weren't supposed to be here in the first place. But hey, there's no need for the other Spider-Man. The villain from this dimension is defeated and gone. Apparently all this time there was someone actually hunting down these Spider-Man one by one. No, it wasn't the Green Lantern. It was actually a villain that goes by the name of Prowler. He was seen talking with the thugs, so the Spider-Man spotted him pretty easily. Plus, he was kind of bright purple. He kind of looks like a Teletubby. But they began to fight him. Prowler has this ability to temporarily make holograms of himself, confusing the other Spider-Man. He's kind of like Naruto. 
Spider-Man were definitely quite confused on how to tackle this fight. This guy was so much stronger than the Green Goblin, and it took them a while. No, so yeah. <laughs> Get him in the corner. Get him in the corner, boys. Get him in the corner. Get him in the corner. Where is he? Spider-Man, attack. What are they fighting? Get him in the corner. Get him in the corner. Get him in the corner. Oh, shoot. Oh, web them, web them. Smack his leg. You should not have given everyone spider suits. Why are the two of them? Legendary leg attack. Bro, why are you guys sticking them onto you? <laughs> why is this the villain? He's on the villain's team. Oh my god, there actually is two of them. What's happening? Dash is just kidnapping him. After a while, they did end up killing off the Prowler. Once again, not arresting him and putting him behind bars like they're supposed to. They just straight murk the dude. Oh, all right. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, just what I am doing, Spider-Man, can he hang to the ceiling? Oh, God, he's here, he's here. Another one? What the heck is a Nasu? Why did it have to be one? Why did it have to be this? What is a Nasu? New York City. Oh, my God. What is happening? Where'd he go? He's gone. Everyone light as many fires, but build such fire as you can. They're burning. Oh, I thought they were an innocent player. I should not be trusted with a flint and steel. A flint and steel? You should not be trusted with a suit, bro. Oh, my God. You guys are ruining the city. Our hero realizes that the Prowler was actually his uncle. He was outraged by all the Spider-Men. He separates from the group of heroes to take some time from the loss of losing his uncle, and rightfully so. Definitely not adding that because Oweka just started walking around aimlessly. When did I mention that the Spider-Man also burnt down the building as well, leaving a trail of burnt down buildings and a trail of blood on their hands? In their defense though, these villains are leaving a trail of blood themselves by killing off the Spider-Man. Not all 100 of them ended up surviving these two fights. The Spider-Man don't bat an eye though, and go on to following the trail that the Prowler left behind. They got a lead that led them to a high rooftop building where they end up meeting Dr. Octopus. Then they began to fight Doc Ock. Guys, the building is now on fire. Oh my god. Where is he? He's there. And if you're confused about what's happening, me too. Let me explain. Basically, the Spider-Man over here are very confused because they don't know that Dr. Octopus is the NPC in the middle. They thought it was some random civilian they had to save. Hey guys, we have to save the, the, the person. Yeah, They're not supposed to save him. Save show, show. That's not a civilian, bro. Where's the civilian? <laughs> He's in the burning building. And should I even start on how dumb these Spider-Man look? Like, they're literally looking at Dr. Octopus and just standing there doing nothing. And words cannot even come to describe how I felt after seeing Doc Ock being thrown off the side of the building. These guys are insane, and I'm talking about the Spider Man. First, it was vandalizing, second, it was burning down buildings, and now we're just throwing people off of high rise buildings. Like, what? What are you guys doing? Guys, the buildings are on fire. It's lag because of all the arson. Okay. Committing. Stop committing arson. Guys, I need help. I need help. Guys, help me with the Doc Ock. Don't take him. Don't take him. Oh my god, no. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, get him, guys! I don't know if these guys are the, are the good guys. He's blue. Why is he blue? Where are you at? Because I froze him. I froze him. That's why he turned blue. Oh, oh I accidentally shot sir. But no, why is guy, 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 guy no being electrocuted? Spider-Man uses a medieval sword to kill Green Goblin. <laughs> Over here, web swinging into a burning building. <laughs> Some of the other players at this point decided to start mining and stacking up for some reason. I can't even tell you. I don't know. They probably started speed running, to be honest. Like, look at this dude making a whole base with a tree in the middle of it on top of one of the skyscrapers. If you wanted a base, you're surrounded by them, buddy. Guess some of the Spider-Men were also really settling in this world. No consequences for their actions, at least for now. <laughs> 
Oh uh, my god, diamond. Are you guys fighting? What the? Well, you guys, we got. Oh, wait, wait, he's gone, he's gone. Oh god, it's going down. They end up defeating Dr. Octopus. Not killing him, though. He ended up fleeing the scene, confusing the Spider Man a bit more. But they followed him to a different place. Our hero at this point was actually doing something he probably shouldn't have been doing. Instead of focusing on the overarching enemy, which is Kingpin, he ended up meeting another being that came through the rift that wasn't supposed to be there a symbiote. The symbiote went ahead and merged with our hero, changing his suit to a different color, and he began to look a little bit different. He then begins to search for the 99 spider man in this dimension that don't belong here and began to fight them. His goal was no longer to side with them, but to kill them. It might be the symbiote talking though, I can't lie. They began to fight between our fallen hero and the other spider man oh, 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 no. Venom! I think we're about to OP. Because it's the spider verse. No, who's stuck me? Who's stuck me? You're the spider verse. I'm so Guys, hungry. Guys, no, no. Kill Venom. Red, kill Venom. Blue. I hate Venom, so let's kill him. We gotta kill Venom. He's gonna kill Dog Dog before us. It's me kill the kill. Good, I'm still fighting Dog Dog, bro. We got Venom. He's attacking me. Kill Venom. Kill Venom. Guys, I got GT. I placed him again. Kill Venom. Go with Sama Ho. Put him in the GT. Thank you. You're a failed abortion. Wyatt. Why is Superman here? Why oh, is Superman not here? here? Put him in our web, put him ah, in our web. Put him, put him in your webs. Put, put him in a white put stuff. Him in I'm still stuck in a white stuff. What? what? Where's the building down? Friendly fire, friendly, friendly fire. Friendly fire, guys. Friendly fire. No one's... I never liked Tony Stark anyway. Come here. He wants me, bro. Man, stop webbing me up. Guys, yeah. my sword broke. I have no weapon. This fight had a lot of back and forth as well. He ended up giving a lot of the Spider-Man nausea and blindness due to the concussions he gave them. Our hero was not going down easy, but the Spider-Man kept throwing punches and hitting him, and kept web-slinging him. A weird thing that ended up happening due to the rift was that there were heroes from the DC Universe that started to peer in. This just doesn't make any sense anymore. This place just kept getting more and more unstable. Superman began to laser eye our hero, making it even more difficult to fight off these guys. <laughs> oh my oh, god, is that the flash? Breaking news, Spider-Man uses a diamond sword to kill Prowler. <laughs> <laughs> hey, who's pulling me? This is a spider run. Spider goons, get him. Oh, wow. Wow. No, no, we got kill the Prowler. Him. Wait, why is Doc Ock here? We got a weapon, why yes. <laughs> Miku keeps trying to rob I'm not Venom, sure. bro. He's in the corner, guys! He's in the corner! Let's go. Get him! Keep him in there! Keep him in there! No, why would you do that? Keep him there, quickly! He's cornered! He's cornered! Oh, no, I didn't get him! Oh, God! Don't worry, guys! I got the help! I got the help! Get him, Spider-Man! Get him, Spider-Man! This was looking like a rough battle for him. And closer to the end of Oweka's life, they began to fire explosives at him because he just kept regenerating. As if he was this world's threat, a huge crater forms beneath his very feet and bombarded with superheroes. Spider cripple, let's cross a forest fire. Oh my god. Guys, 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 Spider Man bones out the Amazon forest. <laughs> Got the achievement for getting wood. <laughs> Oh, this is gonna be bad. This is gonna be bad, dude. How did oh, I get no. a oh, God. Oh, no. There he is. Get him. Get him. Thanks, your DD. Oh my god, where's Venom? Venom's still here! Oh my god. Yes, uh, we need more TNT. Oh, whoa. yes. Oh, <laughs> oh he's so Wait, close! Come on, bro. He's dead, he's dead! Oh, oh, no. oh, 
Let's go! Aweka, after the fight, ends up fleeing the scene, bleeding out from it. The symbiote that he was merged with was beat as well. He walked around the streets and ended up turning into a bit of a monster in the end. He was just filled with outrage. Our hero ends up stumbling upon Gwen Stacy, a supergirl that ended up going through the rift as well. She was super nice, but since the symbiote was clouding his mind, telling him to go against her, the symbiote that infected him ended up switching bodies to Gwen Stacy. And Gwen Stacy is now under the control of the symbiote. She first wanted to side with the other spider man but now it runs over to the other spider man to get revenge. Our hero at this point is symbiote free, luckily for us, so he waits for the right moment to get back in and help the spider man out with the thing that they're trying to do, but he feels that it's too rash of an idea. But he does have another plan in mind. Gwen ends up entering the fight, and the other spider man deal heavy amounts of damage to her after realizing she too is also infected. Whoa. Gwen Stacy? Fighting Gwen Stacy. Yeah, this is our friend. Why are we fighting Gwen? Why are we doing it? Just, like, run away. Where is Gwen at? I wanna hit people with snowballs. Oh, no, we're supposed to kill her. Okay. Let's talk okay. and talk legally again. No. There's a skeleton shooting everyone now. Out of nowhere, the Black Panther appears. This rift is really getting out of hand. Who's next, the Hulk? She has fast movement, so it's a bit hard to keep track of her. They end up blocking her off in a corner as they throw punches, but she ends up inevitably escaping. Oh, he's over here! That's I don't see him murder. anymore, though. Murder. I Wait, will you guys. I die from this? Oh, yeah. Gwen. Oh, guys, I'm gonna go to Spock! Oh, 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 okay. It's Gwen Stacy. Oh, no one cares about Gwen. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, they said nobody cares about Gwen. Glowed hair, explode hair. I got it, I got the TNT down, I got the TNT. Oh my god, this is such a bad idea. Oh yes, let's go, one, one hitting the local livestock. I found a, I found a, uh, No, don't steal it, Gwen! Don't worry, I got her back, this is a robbery. Oh, <laughs> she's in here. Don't worry guys, I got honey bee in the lens. <laughs> no! You guys Block her in! Block her in! Get her! Wait, place TNT in there! Place TNT! Place TNT! No, don't place TNT! We can't tell him to jump out of the Yeah, yeah, someone's grabbing me. They blocked her. Wait, what is this? Get her legs, get her legs. Wait, he's out somehow! What the hell? No! Don't let us go! Get her, get her! Clance is actually sabotaging. Wait, oh, I'm stuck. I got snowballs, Wait. don't worry guys, I'll prove we get more light in here, I cannot tell. Uh, oh! Let me out. I want to be super. <laughs> oh. Let me get. I want to get back in the action. Oh, no, this is this is not the action. <laughs> yeah. Wait, Gwen died, but after a while, she ends up defeated. Now the Spider-Men are kind of out of luck. There's no more leads, and they've been just fighting their friends at this point. So we go back to our little hero, sneaking into Kingpin's headquarters in search for why the Spider-Man rift even happened in the first place. He fights against a couple bandits and searches around the facility in search for some clues and his whereabouts. Adrian, look up. Oh my god. What, what are you doing? I'm using my spider. Uh, what's going on? Who is this? Okay, okay. You don't see friendly. You don't see friendly. They back, bro. Oh, bro. Poor civilian. That was a guard. Whatever. Uh, what else? Hmm. Um, what the? Bro, why am I? The okay. What is in there? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the? Bro, what? The bro, my answers? Bro. bro. Oh, this was like Sarah, and this was like my mom. What the heck Bro. are you talking about? Apparently, they had other spider people being tested in here. It was a spider verse experimentation. Our hero looks around for some sort of clue as to how to take all these spider people back. Uh, and what? Yeah! Oh. What? <laughs> Y'all are behind this, bro. Y'all cooked my mom. Now nah, I'm gonna hop on the roof, bro. Y'all can't get up here. Get, get me up here. You feel me? Oh, stay away, bro. Bro, you can't even hit me from here. All right, whatever, bro. You wanna do this? I'm freaking Spider Man. I'm doing this for you, Dad. Look at me. Bro, whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I can bring my family back alive. Stay back. Mess him up. Mess him up. Get out of here! Oh, the last one! And that's when he meets King Pin. King Pin versus Oweka begins. I should really just be grabbing onto the wall type. Bro! Chill! Oh, why'd you have to do this to my family, bro? Alright, 
Oweka, remember our deal, bro. If you kill this guy, I'm killing all the other Spider-Men. Oh, facts, 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 facts. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Check it, check it, check it. I'm looking, I'm looking. Bro, this guy does not know who he's messing with, bro. It's Spider-Man, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. This is from my ancestors type stuff, bro. Oh my gosh. Hey, check this out. Oh, combo. Oh, oh, you can't hit me. Oh my gosh, I dropped him. Oh my gosh, yeah, bring your back up, bring your back up, I don't even care, bro. I'll even spawn my friend. <laughs> oh, he's not even on my side. <laughs> Alright, bro, that's enough, bro. I'm actually done with you, bro. You actually fell off, bro. Like, I don't know who you think you are, bro. Like, you're getting combo wamboed right now. And you really trying to bring back your homies like that. You on my dead like that, bro. On my dead. Nah, you know what, bro? Honestly, bro, those other Spider-Men, they can roam the town. Screw our deal, bro. This guy's just annoying, bro. I'm out. Before Oweka or Kingpin could actually become the victor, Oweka ends up fleeing the scene. I'm out, bro. But he also runs into a robot that is outright out to kill him. Our hero escapes via the sewers and finds a creepy villain down there known as Killer Croc. And this is when a mini boss begins. Bro, you really want to do this right now, bro? Let me on my jolly way. Bro, you really gonna do this? I'll even get in your tap a tap. Let's do this! Like, I'm really Spider Man, bro. You can't do all this, bro. You can't do me, bro. You can't do that? Yeah. Oh, okay, maybe. <laughs> Ow. All right, bro, chill. Wait, wait, check it. You can't do that, bro. Who do you think you are, bro? Come here, bro. <laughs> bro, who are you, bro? Oh, jeez. He's kind of fast. What you know about some bird fly cookie, bro? I've been trained! Then he finds an escape out of the sewers, but it leads upwards to get back with the rest of the spider man What are these other guys even up to, bro? I swear I've been saving this city since day one. Like, they really just letting pigs roam the streets like this, bro. This is crazy, bro. Who let my math teacher out here like this, bro? That's crazy. What is this? They're leaving the city on fire, Adrian. What did I say? <laughs> They're always nah. doing this, bro. They're always nah, doing this. Nah, this is crazy, bro. This is crazy. It. I swear, I, I've been told you, bro. I'm the best Spider-Man. You didn't listen to me, bro. This is what we get. Respectfully, this is not okay. This is Kingpin has also finally arrived at the fight scene. Ever since Oweka was defeated, he then went on to fighting the other Spider-Man and killing them off. But he was also super weakened by him. The Spider-Man fight Kingpin with all they've got. What's the name of the... <laughs> I think I watched this movie. <laughs> oh, I'm in the web. But Kingpin wasn't the threat here. Since our hero already weaken him a whole bunch so it should be a bunch easier for the other spider-man it was the monster that arrived in the fight that he actually came with so what ended up happening is he pulled out a creature from the rift and that creature was godzilla godzilla literally stomps everything around him breaking buildings breaking skyscrapers he tears this place apart like it's nothing chasing down all 100 of the spider-men kingpin even got killed because of the godzilla this is ridiculous you get packed by your own pet bruh this is insane that's too big where's king kong jeez dude oh my my spider-man armor's about to break dude what are you singing, bro? <laughs> it's it's munching on the building. That is nuts. Get Look up. at this guy. Where's why his hitbox? Is still on me. I don't know. <laughs> I want to Bro, why is Kingpin whooping my ass? I guess some of the players thought that this was Kingpin. I don't really know where the resemblance comes from. But do you see how many people are left? Not a lot. Bro, Godzilla's wrecking me. Uh, honey bee, we got this. Honey bee, we're gonna kill this. Oh, that TNT's nowhere near its hitbox. Okay, guys, I'll give you what you want. Oh, whoa. You know what? We take those. I'm out there. I'm out of there. Bro, that did like no damage. They're trying oh, to blow him up. Break. Oh my god, it's floating. It's floating. I'm, I'm just still going up. Jesus. <laughs> Why is he going upward? He's flying. I'm, I'm throwing snowballs. Guys, I've called him. Back I died. Now. Guys, we have a new superhero. It's gonna be a new superhero. I'm my, 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 my sword about to break. I mean, my armor about to break. I highly doubt that you're gonna do any damage. Bro, honeybee, where are you? Why are you in the air? Where's Godzilla? Um, there's no better weapon I can really Oh, wait, here's though. a crater. I mean, is there a gun? Ah! AK. Oh, he's he's tail whipping or something, man. Bro, I'm about to die. What he has so much health. This is ridiculous. 
I'm sa I'm the savior of the story. Goodbye, Godzilla. I'm ending you. Oh, oh the lag. Oh the lag. Oh the, the lag. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Uh, uh. Yeah, this guy is no joke. I am completely fine. Actually, my PC's fine. This is a cluster bomb, Koi. Look at how it's stomping the ground right now. This is crazy. Nah, we need Big Bertha from the Warspawn mod, guys. Yeah, we really do need Big Bertha. We need a better weapon. Diamond swords. <laughs> Diamond swords, that's all we got. Diamond. Oh, no. I'll kill, I'll 1v1 Godzilla and I'll win. I solo. Uh, oh, my God. I'm getting, like, flung 10,000 blocks out. How do you know? Why is there zombie giants? Just stay on Godzilla, oh. guys. I need to run. I'm getting comboed! <laughs> Why is my 1v1 Godzilla? I can't touch Let's him. made a beacon. <laughs> Batman. Batman, oh. I need you. <laughs> Oh, we got Batman in here. Oh my god, what's he doing now? I, I can't. Oh my god. Superhero squad. Wait, the only thing I can use is my gadget, bro. <laughs> I know at this point, it doesn't really make sense the superheroes that we're pulling out of nowhere, but they did really struggle with this fight. So we wanted to give them some sort of a chance on actually killing this thing. And some of their super suits broke as well. Batman, <laughs> we need to kill him. I got this. We need your help to fight. Godzilla, bro. <laughs> I'm spamming him with gas. Oh my god. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna do his atomic blast. Don't worry, I don't need it. All I, I need is my. Ah! Yeah. Alright, okay, I'm gonna go jump him. Ah. You need to. Make, make me whoever you want me to be. You Shazam? <laughs> oh, get him again. Happening. Shazam, oh, I, help, I invite you to help us to beat Godzilla. Uh, oh, if you oh don't shoot. Die. You're getting folded. Oh god. Alright, I'm going in. I can't even I get do. close to Godzilla. Why we got no. the Mandalorian here? <laughs> yeah. oh, I, I ran out of people. Check me out, check me out. Okay, let's go. Oh, it didn't work. Oh my god. Bro, they're beating, he's beating up a little kid. Um, it's coming. Um, help. Oh my god. That's shake. Yeah, wait, I have a big problem. Wait. So something you probably can't tell just by looking at this fight is that Godzilla is slowly regenerating health every single person that he kills, which is making it really difficult for players to actually kill him. Bro, why is Godzilla attacking me? Oh my god. My armor is at a fraction. Uh-oh. Oh, wow! Wow, you really, oh. got, you really got spot killed there. Oh, oh my armor's the broken. Gets you. Guys, my armor's broken. Is, is he regening health? Oh my gosh. Our hero finally arrives at the fight and risks his life. The city lives another day. Sure, there were casualties, but a hero's gotta do what a hero's gotta do. Y'all hype for the new Spider-Verse movie? Know in the comments what you're looking forward to. And if you want another Civilization video just like this one, click here.